Yeah. Hey, what up, y'all? What up, y'all? This your boy LC the one, baby. LC the one to be exact that is. A K A Illmatic one. Two four. And not the motherfucking gang numbers, man. But my actual jersey number I wore when I was in high school. And my warm-up jersey's on the back of my motherfucking chair. Hey, what's up to my LC Nation, my LC gang gang? My LC crew at the birth. What's going on out there in the land where you live? You did, but hey, man, we back, we back, we back with another reaction video, man. I made a some part, you did epic reaction video. You did when I'm talking about everything in the game with these wild friends. Can y'all dig that with a basketball, Jay? <laughs> Tough ass to that baby. Shout out to the NBA and Stephen A. Smith for speculating that the NBA will be back in session. You did. But as you can see from the title of the video, man, this is my reaction to Stephen A. Smith is holding out hope that the NBA season will resume for 2020. You did. Okay, but man, before we get into this video, first and foremost, like I was telling y'all, I'm not gonna be coughing no more in the videos. Have y'all been seeing me call? I told y'all, man, I don't got the corona or whatever they want to call it. You dig what I'm talking about? It sounds like a drink anyway. Y'all know how I rock. But anyway, man, I'm back healthy. About 98.3%. Still got some snot for you. You did, but it be all good in the LCD One's neighborhood. Okay. But as you can see from the title of the video, man, Stephen A was talking about how the NBA. Well, I haven't seen the video yet, but he was saying there may be a glimmer of hope that the season may return and it will be back in session. I'm thinking possibly sometime later next week. I don't know because Kevin Durant did come down with the coronavirus. You know, he has been the latest NBA player to have been, you know, detected of having it. You know, he got contracted with it and stuff like that. Well, he's been tested and he has contracted it. Y'all know what I'm saying. But anyway, man, Stephen A. Smith, is speculating that the NBA may be returned. Now I said uh, they should hurry up, man, because if they hold this out anytime, any longer, it's gonna be bad for uh, for business for other entities like the WNBA. Okay, then the NCAA gonna be competing with the NBA because this is March Madness right now. What's going on? You did. What they play the video? Okay, but um. They gonna have to hurry up. The NBA gonna have to hurry up and get back in session, as well as the NCAA, so it won't be a conflict. Okay, cause we can't watch both. That's gonna be terrible. The schedule is gonna be ridiculous for ABC, cause they hold some, well I think CBS holds most of the NCAA March Madness tournament. Okay, but anyway, man, we gonna watch this damn video, man. It's about seven minutes long and stuff like that. We finna see what Steven they got to say about the NBA returning back in session. So, to give y'all, to keep y'all spirits up, we gonna play some of the things, so y'all know how to do this, man. Hold on. Yeah. Uh-huh. Okay, man, let's get into the video, man, enough of that. Okay, so y'all ready? Y'all ready? Let's get it, baby, let's go. Shout out to Damien and Bianca, and see this so cool. And royalty, you did. Okay, here we go, baby. Come on, Steven, say something good. What you heard? KD is among the four Brooklyn Nets players to test positive for coronavirus. Okay, we know that. He told the Athletic on Tuesday, "Quote: yeah. Everyone, be careful. Take care of yourself and quarantine." Adding that he's feeling fine and not That's showing any doing. symptoms. We're going to get through this. Yeah. The Nets did not identify any players and said Tuesday that of the four players, only one is actually exhibiting symptoms. All four are isolated and are undergoing medical care from team physicians. Ooh, look at LeBron. Uh oh, oh let me get out play my play. Set to undergo uh -huh. coronavirus testing as first reported. Well, I thought they were going to kick it off with LeBron. I'll let you know. I'm ready. Come on, man. Okay. Do you honestly believe it? Body turn. There will be an NBA season. Then Rose, no, I'm geez. starting to doubt whether it'll, it'll even happen. And the reason is this. The, the um, congressional doctor who said that between 70 and 150 million Americans are going to wind up at some point with coronavirus, that, like, if we take that number to be true in a country of 320 million, what? one in four, Hold on, I got to right Hold on. close to one in two might wind up getting the coronavirus. It's a ton of people. 
That's crazy. Did y'all hear that? Um, the issue is not all getting it at the same million. time. So we don't overtax our healthcare system, especially for their elderly and people with underlying immune problems, because it can be deadly, obviously, um, ten times more than the flu. Is that, do you think this but, NBA so season will be resumed? In, in, in the I say yeah. Vaccine in April, it got to, man. The moment, we just Let's cut the rest of the games other, out. And that will we'll get to the playoffs. The virus. Understand, the playoffs, it doesn't yeah. mean that the virus is going to go away. It means it slows the spread so we don't all get it at once because that's that makes it more dangerous. But think it through. What that means is if we still, many of us wind up getting it, but not all at once, that means we're prolonging the duration of the virus. It's going to be around longer. So people who think that we're gonna be self-quarantined and stuff like that or sheltering in place for four weeks or eight weeks, it seems to me Ridiculous. that there's a good chance that that's wishful thinking and that if we are successful in handling this, it's going to go on up to- Hold up. Now, Max just said, we gonna be sheltering in place for four weeks? Huh? Now, the president has just enacted on a bill, okay? A, st a stimulus bill that's gonna help the economy and then help people that's considered to be unemployed, like now, okay? I use my vacation time, I need my money, I need it. Now, they just said we gonna get stimulus checks Dispersed to us in the first week of April, and it's gonna be a thousand dollars. Okay, a thousand dollars. So if we have to sit home again, I'm pretty sure they're gonna be cutting more checks and they're gonna be bigger. You did. Let's get back to it. Come on. Summer, Come on, man. Through the summer, people will be sheltering in place for longer than in anticipated, and that makes me think, Stephen A. Once the ooh, NBA ooh. starts looking at the NFL season, not the preseason. But the regular season, given all the time off, there's a good chance the season winds up canceled. Wow. I can say that the season needs to be canceled. Let's get to the playoffs. My feelings are very, very similar. Uh, but I will say to you that I'm holding out hope. Um, maybe it's because of my love for the game of basketball. Maybe it's because of my love for sports overall. Maybe it's because my belief in this society, once we hunker down and come together, we can overcome anything. That's usually my mentality, uh, pretty much always, to be quite honest with you. Oh, that little bro. There we go. I understand it's wishful thinking more than anything else. When the news came down about Kevin Durant and the Brooklyn Nets yesterday, it, it hurt my heart because now the Lakers are getting tested today. And, and you know, listen, uh, every life matters. Every individual matters. Uh, but when people are in the public eye, uh, situations become more pronounced. And he gets so the ball, imagine, top of the key. Um, well, he gets it in the tree. Or something like that. I don't know what type of shot. Uh, we hope that the cases are limited. You know, uh, Y'all know I'm ready to play about it. Ultimately to the I'm point ready. that it's completely eradicated that we fight and beat uh, this virus that has you know, basically invaded our lives. Yeah. Uh, but when the Lakers get tested today, uh, God forbid if LeBron James comes back and you know, he tests positive and Anthony Davis and other players or whatever, then you're going to look at the NBA and they're going to probably say, you know what? Our projections about June now are going out the window. And so when you look at it from that perspective, there's a lot to be worried about. There's a lot to be concerned. Yeah, man, but why is it that it's only the NBA players that's contracting this damn illness? We ain't heard nothing about MLB. We ain't heard nothing about the NFL. We ain't heard nothing about soccer. We ain't heard... It's only the NBA getting it. What's... Come on, man. Let's get back to it. About, um, obviously, the, the health of all of us takes precedent, uh, but we're all craving sports as well. We wish that the games were back. We wish that people uh, didn't have to stay in their homes. Uh, we wish that people were smart enough to know how to practice social distancing uh, more frequently uh, and prioritize it. I remember I was watching CNN yesterday and Sanjay Gupta, uh, where people were talking about how he was walking around so frustrated because this is such a serious matter. Yet you see footage on television all the time, people of people not practicing social distancing. Folks still shaking hands with one another. Yep. Each other's presence. Uh, Max Kevin if and I have do on several occasions. And what do I find? I'm seeing people on the basketball court in the park playing sports with one another. No regard whatsoever to the social distancing recommendations. 
that have been disseminating uh, throughout the airwaves and beyond nationally and internationally. And so when you see that kind of stuff going on and you hear about more and more and more cases, it's going to elevate the level of concern and worry. And ultimately, it's going to force the leagues uh, to cancel. I'm still hopeful that that won't happen uh, because all hands are on deck. But I'm very, very worried to say that. I'm with you, Stephen. Okay, man. We heard what Steve had to say about the man. And, you know, I feel him 100%, you know, everything he's saying, you know. And, uh, but my big issue is why are they just, you know, Everybody insinuated that the NBA players have this virus and nobody else got it. That's, that's wrong, man. That's like slander defamating the NBA. Come on, man. They ain't testing nobody else out and nobody else getting it. Come on, man. This, this is something. This is, But that they know NBA is the most percolating thing in sports right now. Basketball is the most percolating thing in the world. Without You see how the, the, the devastating loss and the effect that it's had, had on the 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 world so far because they ain't nobody they're not playing but we gotta get up out of here man for real, for, hey this your boy lc the one baby lc the one to be exact that is a k a illmatic one two four and not the mother sucking game numbers man but my actual jersey number i wore when i was in high school and my warm up jersey on the back of my Motherfucking chair. Like I always say, man, keep it pimping and the voice clipping. Because they will get your motherfucking ass if you slip on that motherfucking banana peel. You did what I'm talking about, man. And like I always say, man, trust me, remember, y'all going. Formally, shout out to my LC Nation, my LC Gang Gang, my LC Squad. Y'all like this video. Share this video. Step back. Call me Mike. Comment on this video, man. And most importantly of all, man, subscribe to my YouTube channel, man. And turn the notification bell button on. To get more exclusive, no content from Pimp Play Gangs Hustle. All about man, baby. I'm healthy. And like I always say, man, touch a rubber guy, we go on the five, a four, a three, a two, a one. Church and them. Yeah. 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 Hey, man. I'm just going to keep it 100 with y'all, man. <sighs> Niggas out there, man. Yeah. They're saying I ain't the OG, the original. Yeah. Hey, man. Who's a duplicate? Yeah. Who's a duplicate? Who's a dude, nigga? Yeah. Who's a duplicate, nigga? Who's a duplicate? Who's a dude, nigga? And I'm the original motherfucking OG, nigga. Yeah, don't forget to get your custom t-shirts, you dig what I'm talking about from LC the one. You see the custom prints all over the shirt, you dig what I'm talking about. We ain't playing no game. The custom sweater, you dig what I'm talking about, yeah. Uh-huh. With the back end print on the same. I got the t-shirts as well. You did unisex, long sleeve. You dig now we got the full zip up. You dig what I'm talking about. Stood up with the hood on it. Stood up with the back print as well. You dig what I'm talking about. We ain't playing no game. And then I got the full zip up. Custom with the pockets on it and the stuff. You dig what I'm talking about. Back print. And sleeve and print. You dig on to my prints everywhere. Then I got the yoga pants. You dig on to my joggers. You dig on to my for men. And I got the crop new t shirts for the ladies. You dig on to my look at that. She look comfortable in it. Uh huh. Then I got the sports bra. You dig on to my get the sports bra. You dig on to the back print print. You dig on to my the back print print. You dig on to my we ain't playing no game. And then I got the yoga pants for the ladies. You dig on to my biker booty shorts. You dig on to my for that. Put that piece can round out. You dig on top of Then I got the, the yoga leggings. You dig on top of my over. She jogging and everything. And I got the capris right there with the custom LC right between the thighs. You dig and I got the, the custom socks. You dig on top of You ain't gonna find no more socks like that nowhere on the planet. And then, last but not least, I got the LC the one jersey. You dig on top of Then I got the back print on there. Look at that back print. Look good. Then I got the Illmatic one, my street ball jersey with the two fold on it. And then I got the little sleeve pull up bag right there for the ladies. You dig on Draw screen back, and then I got the real backpack. You know what I'm talking about? LC the one, look at the back, look at the front. You think I look at the top? You think I'm talking about everything is looking good? You think I'm talking about in LC the one's neighborhood? And then I got the X Star iPhone 10 case. You think I'm talking about? And then I got the iPhone 6 case 7, 8, 9. Let's order what you want. And then I got the custom print. You think I'm talking about LC the one, baby? And then I got the custom mug. And when you want to get drunk and drink and stuff to my stream, and then I got the snuggle pillow when you want to get snuggled with your lady yeah